Back at it again with another video. Yeah, I'm mad late, but this is demonstrated by CC. Back at it again. My edges ain't cooperating, so the head wrap, the product can't even stay quiet. But the head wrap goes stay on today. You know what I'm saying? Cause um, sis ain't looking. Sis got off work, and I'm not looking up to par right now. You know what I'm saying? I did a quick makeup job. It looks alright. Little basic thing, but anyway, I am reviewing the website Brandless for you guys today. Every item is literally three dollars. They have spatulas, toilet paper, chips office pens everything that you could possibly need for your home and office right there on the website so it's brandless.com everything's three dollars like i so i spent approximately forty dollars with the voucher yeah i bought like 20 plus items i kind of went crazy i want to try a lot of things first and see if i liked it and then you know go from there so we're gonna start here now. So we have bath tissue. So it comes in six rolls. I haven't really opened it yet. I opened the box. It's real big. I forgot to say all that. It says brainless on the side. This is like 16 pounds of BS. But here we go. It's the bath tissue. It's bio-based product, brandless. Made from sugarcane and bamboo grass, tree-free paper products, septic safe and biodegradable. 302 ply sheets per roll. So it's six rolls. I'm gonna feel how soft they are. I officially have Charmin Ultra in my bathroom right now. I love that toilet paper. So let's see if this is. No, it's kind of thin. I kind of see my screen through it. Yeah, it's toilet paper. I mean, wants to get it. I mean. Everybody wants to take comfortable poop nowadays, if you know what I'm sure. Okay, I opened this to see the flavors inside, check, double check the flavors inside. But this is the Fruit Tea Herbal Sampler. Everything's $3, so I'm not going to say the price every time I pick a item. This is organic, no artificial colors or flavors. And of course, it's going to say brandless, They'll have the brandless check mark on it, like every other item. So it comes with... Peppermint herbal tea, chamomile herbal, blueberry green. That sounds interesting. I want to try that. And pomegranate white tea. That sounds interesting. Three dollars. It comes with. of each flavor so approximately 20 it doesn't it doesn't even say how much come in the box for real, for real. it does not say oh it does say five tea bags of each flavor i just need to put my glasses on I'm kind of blind right now next to kind of wrap this up i wanted to check every check to make sure nothing was broken so i kind of unwrapped everything and i tried a couple things but it's okay i'm gonna try everything for you on camera this is the Texas style barbecue sauce. It's organic, no artificial colors, no artificial flavors, no preservatives, and it says the brandless check mark, of course. It's 40 calories per serving. Each serving is about two tablespoons. Do you have to refrigerate this after opening? And let me just say this, I can actually read all the ingredients. I don't see any weird names and weird things in there. This is non-GMO, it's also vegan and it's brand tax free. The point of brandless is everything is tax free. We pay for everything with the brand, we have an extra tax to it. So we don't pay the tax that we would because this doesn't have a brand on it. Shake well refrigerate, I am not opening this right now because I'm not refrigerating nothing right now. It's not happening. Next, 
we have the roasted garlic pasta sauce which is also organic gluten free vegan no artificial colors and it's breadless okay. so it's approximately 24 ounces this is three dollars like come on now you can't go wrong next two packs of whole wheat pasta if anyone knows me whole wheat pasta is my favorite and then it's the tri-color pasta and then it's the regular plate pasta but i love whole wheat spaghetti so this is three dollars for two packages can't go wrong i got honey for three dollars honey is expensive in the supermarket if you see like i love the one in the freaking gummy bear what is it gummy bear uh honey bear bottle this is organic it's true source certified it's also gluten free there's a lot of people nowadays that are gluten intolerant it's also non-gmo certified organic honey organic honey for three dollars this is eight ounces those honey bears it's not worth it those are 7.99 i think if i'm not if i'm not mistaken those are 7.99 this is three dollars Here, you're cold right here for six dollars right here and they sell medicine too they sell organic vitamins they sell medicine too but I, I, I will try that soon but we gonna ease into that first we gonna see how these products work and then we gonna go to the next step next left now so we gonna move to the snacks so we got chocolate cream cookies so this is like a play on Oreo supposedly it looks very thin in the picture. I haven't opened the box yet. I left this for the video. So this is organic, no artificial colors or flavors, no artificial preservatives. It's 120 calories for two cookies. And they said there's 14 servings, so 14 times two, that's 28 cookies. Uh, $3, yeah. I can read the ingredients. Da, 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 non-GMO. Ba, 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 ba. I mean, there's nutrition labels. You want to read it? Man. Okay, so let's open it. Let's see. Ooh. Comes in a little silver bag. Ooh. Oh, it's in a tray. It's not just in a bag. Okay. Like a little Oreo tray. So they're trying to be a knockoff for Oreo. Let me not say that name too much. Mm. So it's two trays. They look like Oreo thins. Baby, you want to try this? Tell me how it tastes. Does it taste like a real Oreo? Oh. Huh? You play Madden, like live, whatever, freak not. Talk to whatever fuck. Can you wanna try this? Can you try this real quick? And tell me if it tastes like a real Oreo? It's an Oreo. Tell me if it tastes like Oreo. No? How much out of 10? A oh, six out of 10 from my boyfriend. You know what? I ain't doing nothing. Why well, blame me for messing up in Madden? Cause you swear he in the top two percentile of Madden. That I mess him up. When I come home from work, I mess him up. Sure I do. Next. Oh, I got. Oh. Like thin cookie, pretty crunchy and pretty potent in your mouth. Potent. So, this is the dry roasted and salted in shell pistachio. This is three dollars. It came literally filled above here because it was closed, so it came floating. Sorry, I ate some out. I ate some of them. I'm eating on camera for you guys. It's like a regular. It's actually, it's damn good for three dollars. The super is eight dollars for a damn bag. This is filled to the brim, five ounces for three dollars. So you can just stock up, stock up, stock up on these, and it makes more sense than going to the freaking supermarket. Now, where am I gonna put this? Behind me. Next, so we got some gummy fish. So it's a eight ounce bag for three dollars. Of course, it's non-GMO, gluten-free. 
made with cane sugar, no artificial flavors. It's also fat free, no preservatives, no HS, HFCS, and it's brand tax free, of course. We're gonna try that and see if it's any good. There's definitely ain't no Swedish fish. Don't look at me. What are you looking at? Don't look at me. So, you wanna have a Swedish fish? Very sweet. Mm. Stop chewing and then talk. You know how with a Swedish fish, you, you squeeze it, it has a little bounce back. With these candy, they don't really have a bounce back to it. I don't know if it's because it's for a, it has no gluten in it or the ingredients. I don't know if it's the way they mix it. I don't know if it's because it's organic and they don't use any weird products like the support, like the co candy companies do use. It doesn't have a bounce back. It's just rubbery, like, and it doesn't, it's just, it's good though. It's good though. It's $3. You know what I mean? You still watch the Swedish Twitch though. But it's three dollars. You can't do one. Next, I opened this one. Gummy lemonade rings. I didn't taste this one. My boyfriend did. He said it tastes alright. No bounce back, of course. It's just all gummy. Yeah. Mmm. It doesn't really do it. I like the flavor though. The lemonade flavor. That's spot on. I love this. This? This is my new go to for that. I like it. See? This is what I'm talking about when I say the pistachios are really filled to the top. To the top. So, this is the roasted and salted cashew, non GMO, no artificial colors, no artificial flavors, no preservatives, and they are brandless as well. I'm gonna open that and try that. Mm, yum, yum. I like my cashews to have a crunch to them. These don't really have a crunch, but they're still good. Next, sour gummy worms. These are not gummy worms. Gummy worms are supposed to have a, supposed to. These don't, in your mouth. These are rubbery and they get stuck in your teeth. Like I already have a cavity right now. I'm getting a filling next week. I don't need no more. Like, I'm oh, sorry, I'm chewing my whole. No, it's hard to chew. It's a gummy worm. It's not supposed to be hard to chew. But the lemonade rings, worth it. Three dollars and everything. Gummy fruit wedges. I'm not a fruit wedges kind of person because they're kind of thick. And when you bite them, they're like, and you know the fact that these candies don't really have a bounce back to them. And then biting them, and they're just like. And they're not doing anything for me. See? Stick. Stick, sticky, chewy candy. Ah. Ah, too much candy. So we have veggie chips here. Non GMO, gluten free, no artificial flavors or preservatives. 140 calories per one ounce serving, and it's this bag is nine ounces. I love veggie chips. You know, like the veggie sticks. These feel like they look like ladies. But okay. Mm. But that's what it look like. It's not, it tastes like. It's Okay, I won't eat them all. I'm gonna fill my stomach up on these. I love these. And you taste mad good. These is pretty much spot on. These are spot on. Veggie chips brand. This is, I thought this was interesting. I never had those things like this. Tomato basil hummus chips. Interesting, right? That's what I thought. Non GMO made with chickpeas, gluten free, no artificial colors or flavors. And no artificial preservatives. This is a nine, a five ounce bag for three dollars. Let's try this. Oh, my cute little mini rice cake.
These are very interesting. They're not spicy, but they got seasoning, and you could tell. And it's good. <laughs> A bit didn't waste her money. That's the one thing I don't like to waste. I don't like to waste food, and I don't like to waste money. Sweet potato tortilla chips, 6.5 ounces. You know, tortilla chips, of course, they sell salsa too, but I have salsa in my fridge. I'm not gonna add the salsa until I try y'all stuff first. Sweet potato tortilla chips. Interesting. Interesting. This is what I'm most excited for. Crushed pepper and truffle oil popcorn. If anybody knows me, they know oh I have an obsession. I have an obsession with Gordon Ramsay. And Gordon Ramsay, everything's finesse, 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 finesse. And when I hear truffle oil, I think finesse, 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 finesse. So when they put truffle oil on popcorn, I think Gordon Ramsay. And Gordon Ramsay makes me happy. And this popcorn makes me happy. So here we are trying it. So it is organic, 100% whole grain. And it's also gluten free. Oh. The truffle air brings out a different, different flavor to popcorn. Mm. And the pepper is just like a zing, like, mm. It's like, is that what that do? do, do? No. Listen, I'm Jamaican, I just go, and when, when the good Lord tells me and my great ancestors tell me to stop putting seasoning, that's when I stop putting seasoning in the I don't know all this. But that's what it looks like. It's not, it tastes like. It tastes like they put some of it there. So we have the <clears throat> pita chips. They're, these are non-GMO, vegan, no artificial colors or flavors. And these are the brand list as well. 130 calories for nine servings. And this is a nine ounce. I think I'm just excited to eat. Don't, don't mind me. What I hate about certain certain pita chips is that they're too thick and they're hard to chew if you don't have something to dip it in. And I don't mind eating it plain. This is like a perfect thickness. It's good. Let me show you how it looks. Hold on. Let me show you how the pita chip looks. It's like a thin pita chip. Not thick. Still. So right here, nine ounces, I mean, three dollars. Please should be able to three dollars no more, just five dollars a bag plus. Mm. Sweet barbecue popped potato crisp. This is a five ounce bag. I keep jumping the gun because it's the only Mmm. Okay. Oh, return that shit. Return that shit. It's like a popcorn in a way. Okay. Okay. I think it's the last of the snacks, but not the least. Olive oil and sea salt popcorn. Organic, 100% whole grain, gluten free, no artificial colors or flavors, non GMO, no artificial preservatives, and brand tax free. 4.6 ounces. I just also gotta say, the popcorns weren't $3, they were two for three. And I think some of the chips are two for three as well. It just depends on the flavor. Because they're all made differently, of course. Because some of them are potato crisps. Some of them are chips. Some of them are 
popcorn tears. I don't know. Confusing. But these were the popcorns were two for three dollars. So one fifty for this. Not even three. And this is a four point six ounce gap. Let's try this. This popcorn tastes more regular than the other one because the other one has the pop pepper on it. Oh my god, nobody saw that. I can't eat popcorn. But the other one has a pepper on it, so it makes it taste like a way different type of popcorn. So this is not a normal popcorn. Time to go to the movies. I got all these snacks. Time to go to the movies. I got all these snacks. You know, I am. Moisturizing hand soap. This was all the way at the bottom because I kind of just threw it in there because I was going to put this in my bathroom. So it is conditioning lemongrass extra le lemon verbata. It's cruelty free, brandless, sulfate free, no five phthalates, no animal testing, gluten free as well. It smells really good. Like spot on. Like $3. Like, brainless but I do love coconut cuz I am a Jamaican girl if you know what I mean me a Jamaican girl so this is potato snacks original toasted potato potato coconut chips I can't even read I usually get my coconut chips from Marshall's or TJ Maxx you know in their snack out they always got like apple chips and some weird weird stuff like this they always got coconut chips for some reason and I like the caramel sea salt because they put extra sugar in that one. It doesn't really taste like caramel, but they put extra sugar in that one, and I love sugar, and I love coconut. Don't mind me. I wanna try this on camera too, real quick. Oh, it's like a clump. It's like a coconut clump. Okay. Yeah, I should sell this on there. Make some coconut crisp, brainless. Make some coconut crisp. That would be good. Mm -mm. Anyway, thanks, brainless, for the products. Forty dollars, well spent. I would definitely be ordering again. I definitely want some more crap. Just send the crap to me. Like I love crap. Crap. crap, crap. Let me stop. <clears throat> But anyway, this is demonstrated by Cece. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. Get these stacks because they're mad good. And yeah. Follow me on Instagram. Add me on Snapchat. Follow me on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know, you don't want to miss out on my posts. A girl. Follow me on Instagram, add me on Snapchat, follow me on Twitter. This is demonstrated by Cece, again with another video. Like, comment, and subscribe to your girl.